What's up, guys? Welcome back here to an episode of the Bass and Brews. Uh, so here's a continuation of our uh, Bass on a Budget series. We're talking about our electronics today. And um, this is just about setting up your Active Captain. Uh, I've already done a video on this, but uh, the app and the phone is updated a little bit. So I'm just going to walk you through again how to set it up on your uh, Garmin unit, get everything going. Uh, I had to recently reset my unit anyway, so perfect time to set it up. So come along, I'll show you how to set up Active Captain. All right, so here we are on our unit. This is our 93 SV UHD. Uh, so here's what we have to do to start setting this up. So first off, hit Active Captain. And this is just gonna start to walk you through what you gotta do. So initially, you gotta set up your own Wi-Fi network you're gonna connect your phone to. So first off, turn it on. There you go. Now we're gonna configure it for the first time. So this is just the name that this initially pops in. Um, we're just gonna kinda use this straight up. You can change this name to whatever you want, but we're gonna just move forward. It's now configuring that network. And you have to create uh, your own password here to start out with. Uh, just for the sake of this video, we are going to uh, just be super simple. I believe it was eight uh, uh, characters or less. So I would advise you to do something better than this for your um, password here. But we're going to start with just that. So now. It has created a Wi-Fi network. Uh, you can see that the Wi-Fi is turned on. You can change the name of it at any time, which is really nice. You can change your password at any time. And then advanced, this kind of tells you a little bit more. You really shouldn't have to dive into this, but uh, right now your unit is set up for Active Captain, and next you have to set it up on your phone. All right, so here we are back in our phone. Now we need to actually download the app. So we're gonna go to our app store, start looking for Active Captain. Uh, as it uh, starts to search here, scroll down, find the right one, Active Captain. I already have it downloaded, but uh, make sure you download that for yourself. Uh, and then we're gonna go ahead and open it here. So now we have this uh, downloaded. Uh, it's trying to search, it has nothing to connect to right now, but uh, it's downloaded and ready to go. All right, so now we gotta go into our Wi-Fi settings on our phone. I uh, swipe down and then hold the, the Wi-Fi there and go to Wi-Fi settings. And then that's gonna pop up uh, our whole area here. Now we're gonna find that Garmin 9551. That's what uh, it showed on our Garmin, that that was our name. And now we're gonna go ahead and put in our password. And uh, it is now connected. So now we are connected between our phone and our unit. All right, so now that we got that set up on our phone there and connected, uh, this is the very first prompt that pops up. Uh, is a new Active Captain user has been detected? Is it the owner of the vessel? And uh, definitely in this case, uh, yes. So this here, it already knows what my account is because of the uh, Active Captain app that we are connected to. So uh, we're just going to be all done here. A uh, new Active Captain user has been added, and we are working. So as you can see right down over here, it says transferring 37%, so we know it's connected. Um, uh, actually up here it says no mobile device connected because we're not, uh, we don't have the app open specifically on our phone right now. But as you can see that uh, transferring is going up, so it is definitely connected and it is working correctly right now. Uh, we're gonna go back to the phone and open up the app and see what that shows us there. All right, so here we are back in the app. We've got a Wi-Fi connected. We know it's connected on our unit. And there we go, so it's connected to Garmin. And see if we go over to charts right now, kind of check this out. Uh, it does appear to be, you know, working. Here's all of our uh, waypoints from our unit. So it is now connected between the phone and the active captain on our unit. So there you have it. That's how you set up uh, your Active Captain between your Garmin unit and your Active Captain app on your phone. Uh, it's pretty easy, uh, pretty seamless setup here, and it works great. Uh, I really love uh, doing this. Um, it really, just having access to my maps on my phone is, is super awesome. Uh, make sure you check out this video here to help show you how to download your maps on your Active Captain. It's actually super important, so you're gonna wanna check that one out for sure. And uh, thanks for watching. And you know what we say? You can't catch your fish, you can always catch your buzz. Bass and brews.